To excel in respiratory therapy, you need to be a good critical thinker. Respiratory therapists help people in the community by taking care of them when they're at their most vulnerable. When they're the sickest, that's when the nurses call us to come and take care of them. Over the course of the pandemic, we realized we had a major shortage of respiratory therapists. So we're looking for people that are compassionate for their patients, but very passionate at what they do because we are literally saving people's lives. We have a two-year associate's degree that when you finish, you can go to work as a respiratory therapist or the new pathway, which is the bachelor's degree, which you can finish in three and a half years but either pathway will lead you to get a job as a respiratory therapist. Well, with a two-year associate's degree, my students graduate making about fifty dollars to $55,000. And earning a bachelor's degree, they can earn even more. A lot of degrees, you're not gonna make that coming out. Not only that, but it's, it's a rewarding field as well. Over the next 10 years, it's anticipated that we'll have a 23% increase in job growth, so our graduates are gonna be in very high demand. So the need for respiratory therapists is so great that for the first time ever, a community college in the state of Missouri is offering a bachelor's degree and that community college is OTC.